This is a Be Kind to Pets educational video sponsored by Tapayo Vets. This is an 8 year old female Jack Russell. For 3 days, she has not passed any stools. She is inappetent and anemic. When she came in, she appeared lethargic and had abdominal distension. The vet diagnosed closed pyometra. There were three options, either no operation, operate immediately, or operate after stabilizing the dog with an IV drip. The vet decided to operate after stabilizing the dog. This is because the x-ray showed that the uterine horn was extremely swollen and was about to rupture. The blood test also showed that the white blood cell count was 49. The normal count is between 5 and 17. The neutrophil count was 37 and the normal count is between 2 to 12. This shows that there was much bacteria and toxins in the dog's blood. However, as the dog appeared very weak, the anesthetic risk would be much higher. Thus, it was better to stabilize the dog before surgery. These are images of the dog's infected uterus taken out during the surgery. The dog was hospitalized for two days after the surgery, after which it was taken home to recover. Eleven days after the surgery, the owner came to remove the stitches. However, the stitches were removed too early. The wound will have to heal by second intention. It is best to remove stitches about 14 to 21 days after the surgery to allow the wound to close completely. So we got this tissue already. How many side? You can see it. You can see it. See the dog's head also. Cut the knot. Knot the knot. You can see that the vestiges are okay. So the assistant is taking out the 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 stitch. So it will be faster. So slow. So the fellow will be more happy in there. And normally, uh, it can be done quite fast. Uh. Just cut the knot there. My body can come out, it doesn't matter. Yeah, they get it out. Yeah. 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 The success in curing the dog of closed biometra shows that the vet made the right decision in stabilizing the dog before surgery.